division playing against top centers and playing against some, you know, top line defensemen uh, and a schedule that's unrelenting and you're playing a lot of minutes. How do you, how are you dealing with that challenge? Um, that's what I want. Um, I want to be a good player in this league and that's going to take going up against tough matchups, uh, other teams, top lines, other teams, top um, D pairs. Uh, that's the player I want to be. And um, I think it's been good for me um, to I had a good start to the season. And um, I think just I uh, got to find that confidence back and uh, be a good player against top line. Stu Gawain. I'm good. I, I forgot to lower my hand. Uh, Arpin. Um, Nick, overall, like, what's the, I guess, when you, when you finish a game like that where you clearly you guys are not at your best, especially early on, what's the level of concern you feel for the way you guys played tonight? I wouldn't say uh, there's a concern. I think it's just uh, more of a disappointing feeling. Um, we know we can be a good team. Um, these points are matter, going to matter a ton uh, coming down the stretch and over the halfway mark. So um, we need to pick up points. Uh, we need wins, and uh, it's got to come fast for us. Um, we need to start building our game. Uh, just got to take it to the next step. Hi, Nick. I asked you the question, but I was not able to hear you before. Um, last game, you can talk about fatigue with a game with two games in less than 24 hours. But tonight, how can you describe the effort of the team, especially for the first 30 minutes, maybe? Yeah, um, we have to find a way to uh, be better uh, at the start. Um, I thought we had good energy coming to the rink. Uh, I think guys were excited. And um, once the puck dropped, uh, we were sitting back. Uh, they dominated us the first period uh, pretty well. If it wasn't for carry, it could have been a lot worse. Um, but as the game went on, I thought we did a good job of responding. But um, obviously, uh, starting off a uh, bad 30 minutes is going to cost you. Et Simon Olivier. Um, on an unfortunate play, you were hit by Corey Perry behind the behind the net. You seen kind of um, it seemed like you were injured or something. Did you had to go through the concussion protocol or what, what did happen after that? Yeah, um, I never felt anything in my head. Um, I got a got a jersey burn on my top of my lip, but uh, the I think the Someone in the NHL uh, told our trainers that I needed to go back. So uh, I had no uh, symptoms or anything and uh, passed the test pretty easily. All right. Thanks, Nick. Merci.